Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to this Chiefs career mode. Our next game is against the Blues for round 16 of our Super Rugby competition. We are in first place in the New Zealand Conference on 55 points. Eight points clear of second place, the Hurricanes. So let's hope we can continue our winning form. I have up the difficulty. I was going to save it for next season and I was going to go up to pro, but hard just seems to be a tad too easy. So I have upped it and we are on pro for this game against the Blues. It's Super Rugby and a very important game for both teams. Chiefs are not doing well in this competition. Snapping out of their current slump in this match will be key if they have salvaged something from their poor placing. Did they just say that the Chiefs are doing very badly this season? Because I'm sorry, but I think I'll have to disagree sitting top of the table. Anyway, we're playing the Blues. They have got a strong side. Definitely in their back line. They've got a few key names who are going to have to try and shut down Rico Ioani I'm looking at. Marchant and also Bowden Barrett are probably the three biggest names in that back line. We have gone for the exact same team. First game on pro difficulty. Let's see how we go. Hopefully we continue the form that we've had. Big hit on Bowden Barrett for a start. Oh, and straight away they're offloading flat out. A lot of offloads happening. And they have kept the ball at the breakdown. Advantage, it has been knocked on by them. Sam Kane offloads to Leonard Brown, who goes one more, Eli Marlow, who goes to Karevi, who has got the pace. He's stepped. Oh, Bowden Barrett's tied up the legs. We have lost that ball, though. Great tackle from Bowden Barrett there. Great tackle there from Sam Kane. Tarval takes it. No one was ready for it. A Teddy Black has taken it back. And it has ended up in a driving situation. Good hit from Samu Karevi. And it has resulted in the ball being turned over. Tarval takes it behind him. Eli Marlo has lost the ball. This is very different to hard. Oh, Stevenson almost overcommitted. Yeah, Brown has nailed him. Retallick has stolen the ball this game. It's back and forth. Weber, Harris goes wide to Samu Karevi. They're not going to catch him. Samu Karevi gets the first try of the game for the Chiefs. That is a lot more intense than hard mode, I'll say that. Samu Karevi, we were able to break them down after many turnovers occurring. Brad Weber goes wide. Nathan Harris waits perfectly. Samu Karevi was going. Eli Marlow was outside and Marchant almost caught Samu Karevi, but was not able to. Retallick steals it at the breakdown. Sam Kane with the offload. Brad Weber to Nathan Harris. Samu Karevi showing his pace. Okay, the kick. Damian McKenzie has had 100% kicking accuracy this whole season. And I have no idea how fast this bar is going to be. Whew, here we go. Oh, it's a bit quicker. Okay, have I just lost Damian McKenzie as 100 kicking accuracy? No, I have not. Somehow that ball has gone over. 7-0 to the Chiefs. He wouldn't have been happy the way that that one was struck off the boot. But luckily the wind brung it round. Okay, Bowden Barrett to kick off. Matt Todd catches the ball like he always does and he's just been absolutely nailed by Jonathan Ruru. And he's lost the ball because of it. I think what we've got to look out for on this pro difficulty is the amount of offloads that are going to be occurring. We've got to be ready for that next tackle at all times. There it is, one offload, two offloads has been taken down. 
Weber is stuck for some reason. He was just watching. He wanted to admire the dummy that was being <laughs> their mate. Leonard Brown goes to Eli Malu, who sees the gap. Does a little chip. Ardron is chasing. He hasn't got the pace though. Or has he? No, he couldn't quite kick it. Still a good attacking move from the Chiefs, which is what you want. We have turned the ball over again. Oh, it's draw and pass. It's a specialty of the Chiefs, who steps on the inside, Leonard Brown. Of course. That's a huge gap in their back line. Ardron to Jacobson, who misses everyone. Karevi has done very well. But it has been turned over straight away from the Blues. Matt Todd has made the tackle. And is he going to get up in time? Not quite. Great ankle tap from Tarva. Matt Todd up very early. But it was legal. McKenzie was in the back line. Or in the front defensive line, my apologies. Weber has got that ball though. Matt Dodd, quick hands to Stevenson who has nailed in the tackle. And that's going to be a turner. No, it's not. We have managed to keep that ball. Jacobson goes on a little run. Cruden goes on a little run. That was not the best pass. The ball is moving. Weber has been shunted off. In the tackle. Ruru finds support. And they have kicked it. They're going for territory. First line out is going to be one that will have a little bit of added pressure on it. Seeing as it's just outside our 22. Oh, okay. Oh, is it going quick? Yeah, it surely is. Right. That's a good start. We're going to just drive this out a little bit further, if we can. We're going to use it now. Lala goes to Cruden, who goes wider. Jacobson, he's going to have to get rid of that to get a bit more pace on the ball. Leonard Brown goes wide to Stevenson, twinkle toes on the wing. Barrett has made the tackle once again. Working very hard at fullback, but making those crucial tackles. Oh, the back line was in all kinds of tatters there. It was not looking like a back line at all. Hello, Marlow has got the pace. He's trying to step Barrett. Barrett was one step ahead. That's three tackles in a row for Bowden Barrett in this game. That's an interesting angle. I'm hoping that's going to fix itself. Yes, it is. Okay, I've chucked it away, but we're going to a scrum now. Knock on from Jonathan Ruru. I can certainly see the difference in difficulties. That's a massive hit from Bowden Barrett. Unfortunately, the back line. Oh no, I didn't realise it was half time. I wanted to see how quick the scrums were. It's a good sized crowd, and I expect they'll be looking forward to another. Okay, five handling errors for the Chiefs. But we've also made five line breaks. So we are able to get through. It's just we need to get more points on the board. Because I have a feeling that this blue side could score this game. I'm hoping they don't, of course. We always we want to keep a clean sheet. It was all go on the field. So I have a feeling that it could go either way. So we'll have to wait and see for the second half. To see who's going to be able to get away with the win here. Bowden Barrett to kick off. He has gone long. Weber lines it up. He has taken it well. He has been tackled. They're in very early, the Blues. They almost got that. Tarval puts Cruden in the pocket, who just boots it. That's not really where I was trying to kick that, but I did let it go very early. Didn't get as much distance on that kick as we would have liked, of course. Jonathan Ruru goes around the side of the ruck. Karevi was there, though. 
We were just trying to tackle him. And if he got shunted off on hard mode, he's going to have a very hard time on pro. Now tackled to the ground. Lamborn finds Stevenson with the interception. But it's looking like the Blues are going to get that straight back. Because no one was in the Chiefs ruck. Possible turnover here. The Chiefs could have taken this. Built some pressure. And they Wait for Bowden Barrett to run forward a bit. And we'll give that a mighty heave downfield. It's a decent kick. But Bowden Barrett is covering it. And he has sent it straight back. McKenzie has sent it back down. Hasn't gone very far though. Should have taken my time with that one. Good tackle from Brad Webber on a Terry Black. And he almost got back to his feet. Nathan Harris with the tackle. Matt Todd with a big hit on a Terry Black. Webber is offside. That was a rookie mistake I just made. Nice phase play opening up the opportunity. That's a good hit. I think it's going to be our ball here, which means the advantage has not run out. Offside from the Chiefs. It was not Sam Kane. It was the man in the background, Brad Weber. I assume they're going to kick this into the corner. He is looking like he is kicking for the sideline. We able to keep that in? No, we are not. This could be very dangerous if they go for a set play here. Of course, they've got to win this ball first. Oh, I thought Retallick for a second had a chance at that. They're skipping people in their back line. Cut back on the inside, then cut on the outside. Weber has made a very crucial tackle there. Jacobson has turned it over. Cruden, Elo Marlowe, goes one more to Leonard Brown, who offloads it to no one, sadly. Oh, little cheeky round the back offload attempt from Ardron. They haven't got their full back. I'm going to boot it downfield. I'm hoping it pulls up, because there is quite a lot on that, yes. The bounce is favourable for us. Rico Ioani pulls out the step. I'm not sure if that's the right time to do it. We have got them under pressure here. They're about 15 out from their own line, maybe 10. Oh, Akira Ioani breaks one tackle. Weber get on side. They're going wide. Ioani pulls out the step. He's still going. He's galloping. Rico Ioani. But he has galloped into touch. Tell you what, we were down on numbers there. If they had gotten that through, it was looking dangerous. Oh, that's very good. We're going to go for the drive again. We're going to commit a few more people to it this time. We're going to really get it going. The big drive from the Ford pack of the Chiefs. They're pushing hard. They have lured all of the Blues players into their... Oh, what a tackle from Bowden Barrett on Aaron Cruden. That was a terrible floaty pass. Eli Marlow is up for it though. Has stolen the ball. Run for the line, son. Oh, it's intercepted again. It's back and forth rugby. And the Chiefs once again with the turnover. No one can keep the ball here. Tarval to Retallick. Goes a bit wider to Cruden who chucks it away. McKenzie has picked it up with the offload to Tarval who puts it down. Oh, I need to take a breath. Right, I'm going to get the chance to do it. Hang on. No, I'm not. Apparently advantage was over. I would disagree with that statement. We didn't really gain any ground. Or they didn't, sorry. It's 78 minutes. And have they got it back? Push hard, boys. Keep pushing. Keep joining. Come on. No. Not quite. Oh, we're going a big pocket to Barrett. Tell you what, he's made a mistake. It was the 80th minute Bowden Barrett. And that's the end of the game. The Chiefs. 
narrowly get away with the victory with just our one try from Samu Karevi. That was more of a challenge and to be honest I think I enjoyed it more. Of course it was very stressful but what a game that man had Bowden Barrett making a lot of crucial tackles. Their missed tackles were a big issue. They needed to shut but down the ball. But Samu Karevi gets the try and Mackenzie's dodgy looking kick that still managed to go over has won us that game against the Blues. They they really put up a good fight. How many handling errors did I do? Eight. Okay, so that's going to have to get better. Seven line breaks though. I'm happy with that. It was a back and forwards game of rugby that one but the Chiefs get away with the victory. Still only eight points ahead of the Hurricanes. Anyway guys, that's the end of this video. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.